Whitney Young. Good to be back in front of the camera. Your favorite host oh, here, man. Spencer Stoneberg and Jordan Shane. Mm -hmm. Excuse me, I'm waiting. You know, we about to cook up some comedy gold for you right here, right now on Dub TV. TV Dub. Let's get it. Hey guys, this is Miles Miller, class of 2015, and you're watching Dub TV. And this is my roommate, Braylon Saunders Effett, also class of 2015, still watching Dub TV. What? What did you say? What? What? Emoji. What? Emoji. Gosh, emoji of the week. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to Emoji of the Week, where one lucky winner gets to win a Dunkin' Donuts gift card. And this is the Emoji of the Week. Hi, I'm Jordan Buckner, class of 2007, and founder of Chalkbox, and you're watching Dub TV. students. The lost and found will be empty today. Let's go, let's go. Sure did kill that monster. Let's see what she does. Hi, my name is Dana. Hi, I'm Teo. 
and we're going to do a review about She Kills Monsters, a play that was put on by the Young Company this weekend. Yep, I am so proud of everyone who was a part of this performance. It was great. I loved it. Um, I think Declan and, and Calvin deserve an Oscar for their performances. It's amazing. Um, I love the costumes and the scenery. All the special effects are amazing. And the way they created the monsters is great, too. The props themselves were so well made. The masks came alive with the work of puppeteers that were seemed like they were very, very skilled. I thought that this can be and may be one of the best productions that the Young Company has put on this year, as it is the only one. Hope more to come. Yep, and the music was so fitting to each scene. Everyone, all the actors were great. Just a little bit. Be to check out She Kills Monsters December 10th, 11th, and 12th. Get your tickets from the school store. Hi, I'm Sabrina, and I play Vera in the Young Company's production of She Kills Monsters by Kui Gwen. If you haven't already seen it yet, you have four more chances to see it. And you can do it for free because we're doing a ticket giveaway. All you have to do is take a picture with one of the displays in either the arts building or on the bridge. Post it on Instagram with the tag at the Young Company. We will be picking ten people randomly to get free tickets to the show. So, see you there. Union. Check it out. Last month, there were two rallies led by the Chicago Student Union, both located at the Thompson Center. These rallies protested against the $400 million budget cuts that were proposed by Rahm Emanuel and Bruce Rauner, which threatened the positions of our teachers, staff, and how many schools will close next year. Over 700 students participated in these rallies. Everyone should take the time out of their day to thank the teachers and staff in this school for all their hard work, and we should all be appreciative of what they do. Go Dolphins! We're going to hand it over to uh, Miles Baggett, Brandon Sanchez with sports. <laughs> Hi, I'm Brandon Sanchez. I'm Miles Baggett. In the past week, the boys' basketball team faced Simeon in the Chicago Elite Classic. Xavier Castaneda had 18 points and Lucas had 20. Even though the first half was rough, the boys came back in the fourth quarter. The loss by five points showed a lot of heart. Here we go, boys. The past two weeks, the girls' basketball team has started off extremely well. They went undefeated in a trip to Puerto Rico and they won their first conference game against our Raven. This past weekend, they suffered their first loss against Homestead, a team out of Indiana. This week, they have two conference games. Make sure you're there. Make sure you come support our boys basketball team at Urban Prep on their first conference game. Go Dolphins. Yo, uh, I've been struggling lately with eights. I think I need a tutor. Nah. <laughs> he got it. He got it. <laughs> Final girl deserving of this pencil goes to Misty. Today's game is about being creative. You ladies will have to draw something spectacular, as amazing as my drawing below. Whoever has the best drawing will be safe from elimination. Good luck. Okay, ladies, you're going to start drawing. You can only choose one utensil from the table. Get set. Go. One hour later. Two hours later. What are you doing, Misty? Are you going to start drawing or what? Three hours later. Can you move it along? I'm all out of time, cards. All right, let's start with you, Pumpkin. Um, well, you know, Chicago's my city, and so I drew my city, and everything I love about it, look at the little flashlight, is shining on my city, and everything I love, you know how we rock. Wonderful, wonderful. Alright, now cookies. Okay, so I drew 
this person that I love. Who would that happen to be? Kim Kardashian. Kim Kardashian has... Kim Kardashian West. Okay, it looks very solid. All right. And Misty, you drew a dot? Yeah. Care to explain? Well, none of you did as great as I did. But I will have to say the best one, the person with the best drawing goes to cooking. And I will strike down upon thee with great vengeance and furious anger. Those who do not read the beacon. <laughs>